I don't want to say anything like too. <laughs> like. <laughs> Wait, I don't know yet. I'm not ready. Okay. I'm Growing up, I was really energetic, so my mom was always telling me like to sit down somewhere and stop moving around and fidgeting all the time, like I'm fidgeting right now. So, <laughs> and I think being really energetic comes in handy, especially I do a lot on campus. I'm involved in a lot of organizations. I have a lot of classes I have to take that are really hard, so the energy comes in handy now. It wasn't always the best back then, but it helps out. <laughs> when I was a kid, my mom always told me not to talk to strangers. So, but I've learned that you know meeting people uh, is a great way of networking and uh, being in the military was a way that pushed me outside of my comfort zone and then uh, after that I met a lot of great people and made a lot of friends. Okay so in high school um, I was typically I like to kind of stay to myself but I had a big group of friends um, I didn't like to meet anyone new but now that I'm like on campus I had to change that because I came here with no friends so I had to make new friends so like with that being said I got involved a lot on campus um, I was the president of my residence hall um, I joined the fraternity Fiji also known as Phi Gamma Delta and it's like really helped me a lot to like be a little more active on campus and have like a big wide spectrum of friends um, as a woman not to be too loud like not to speak over I've always been like an intro or an extroverted like talkative person like I'll just start a conversation or I'll just be very loud sitting somewhere and I just meet a new person. I'm like, oh hey, I'm Andrea, it's nice to meet you. It's just kind of is a thing that I've just, it's just a characteristic I've always had as a person. When I was growing up, individuals always told me that I wasn't out to be a leader. I wasn't here to do, to be, to, to hold a position of leadership. I wasn't there to, to help people. Um, they always thought that I, I grew up in a very uh, blue collar family and they believed that I was going to end up the same as them. Um, I have since overcame that, you know, becoming the president of the undergraduate student government at IUPUI, a president of the social fraternity, um, heavily involved on this campus and every single day hoping to make a difference in people's day, lives and doing everything I can for them. Um, I think back to what people used to tell me and how I couldn't do things and how I was meant to work in a factory for the rest of my life. I like to think back to those days and think, wow, I, I really made a difference and I really made it. You know?